Around the world in 80 days, a game filled with crash fighting mechanics, packed up flavored static gritty punches in your face. The game is a short, fun fighter, but surprisingly, a death note has been revealed when you play this game. Later on, it get ruthless and disappointing to make you shit another egg out of your asshole. Make it some Easter egg island wipers. This game is a crazy difficulty piece of shit. And I heard you. Piece of shit. Like cowboys and stupid ass ninjas rocking you all over the place, making you feel like an honoring dummy. The little bitch in their own critique. It's a crime based fighting game. What more can it say about being easy? Because it's not easy. It's shit of difficulty. I mean, this gameplay is played by me, and damn, I almost rage quit when I got to the uncensored last boss, where he featured his little pretty uncensored four bosses, which have been PISS ME THE FUCK OFF! YOU STUPID DICK! YOU STUPID DICK! The game has nothing but bland background seen before. You collect these Asian lettering multi-million dollar signs, but you get four, you pass a level, congratulations. For trying, I give it a 6.9 out of 10. Not bad. It's fun for a short time. I wouldn't mind trashing it in some plunging sewer and not traveling with it anymore. 80 days, my ass!